Dan, I, you know, there were parts of Kenobi I liked, but I think it's already not aging well. There's just so much in there. There's just so much in there that doesn't, that just really doesn't fit. And like, what you're telling me is, what you're trying to tell me is that Obi-Wan Kenobi, who knows Darth Vader is, go is, go is going to like wreck the galaxy. Like he knows what's gonna happen here. He, he knows exactly what's up and he knows the stakes. Obi-Wan Kenobi knows the stakes of his fight with Darth Vader. He even said, again, I will do what I must. Last time he said, yeah, I will do what I must, he cut off all of his limbs and left him for dead and believed he was dead. This time he said, I'll do what I must, and he just walked away. He just And I, I just don't get why, I just don't get why they couldn't, like, even attempt to have some kind of legitimate reason um, that Kenobi couldn't stick around, you know? It was like, oh, well, we have, he's just going to walk away because he's a Jedi and he shows mercy. Well, that's the stupidest thing I've ever heard of. He knows the stakes. He knows that he's doing millions of people to die. He's watched. He watched Anakin walk through the streets of that village just murdering people. I mean, he watched it happen. He watched him murder younglings. He knows the stakes, and yet he just walks away from, from Darth Vader alive. I don't know why they couldn't have built in something into... Why couldn't they have built in something into Kenobi where he's about to take out Darth Vader and Darth ba and, and Anakin or Darth Vader actually does something to push him back, like, like just musters every last bit he's got, shoves him backwards, and then, and then somehow escapes. Or you can see the shuttle coming in from the distance to, to rescue and, and come in with Darth, the Inquisitors are coming to rescue him. Kenobi's about to finish him. They fire a laser, or they put something between them. They put a giant... They just do some, something. It should not have been a choice for Obi-Wan Kenobi to walk away from Anakin. That should not have been a choice that he made. It should not have been a choice. The same way that it should not have been a choice for Anakin earlier to not take Kenobi to either kill him or take him prisoner or whatever while he was staring right at him through flames. There should have been different choices made by these characters based on who their character is. And that stuff made no sense to me. And I think Kenobi's gonna age very poorly. Um, I think Kenobi's gonna age very poorly because that just the way that, I mean, Boba Fett might actually age better because the Mando content, honestly. I just think Kenobi's gonna age very poorly and it's just not gonna look good. So that's what I think. That's what I think. That's my opinions on Kenobi. Unfortunately, it had you had so much potential and you just ruined it. They just need to stop touching Skywalkers and Kenobis and move on to new stories. Rogue One was a good story, although, you know, Darth Vader's in there, but Rogue One was a good story. Um, I liked Solo. Solo's actually aging better. And um, I, li I love Mandalorian, and that's not, you know, anyway. They just need to get away from Skywalkers and stuff.